Hey, Dr. Karen here with another edition of the Spiritual Medicine Digest. And I thought just for a change and just for fun that we would do this video in the bathtub. <laughs> and with with some candles going and my new chat lights. So you can actually see my face. Um, so, you know, it's the full moon today. So that's one of the reasons I'm in the bathtub with my Himalayan crystal salt. Wow, this, uh, this flame's going crazy here while I'm talking. Um, anyway... Uh, so the Himalayan Crystal Salt Bath help you to clear um, old stuff, and it's great to clear your aura with the um, with the Himalayan Crystal Salt. Now, of course, it's a little pricey to do a bath every day. That's probably going to cost you twelve bucks a day for a bath. Uh, however, um, doing it through the full moon really helps you manifest. So that's I'm doing that today as a splurge and a, a nice uh, a nice gift to myself. And I've also charged my water with some Aquaware 5.0. And by the way, in case you do not have Himalayan crystal salt handy, but you do have Aquaware 5.0, I did add the intent that uh, Peter Shank, the creator, um, helped me add, and that was Himalayan crystal salt. So, so you can find it right there, Himalayan crystal salt. If you look up Him Himalayan salt, you'll see it there. So if you charge your bath water with that, you'll have the frequency of Himalayan crystal salt. So anyway, what do I want to talk about this week? Well, um, there's a lot of energy moving around right now with regards to mass consciousness. There is so much that's healing in mass consciousness. It's like a big, huge spike, especially since the presidential election. And um, seriously, are people really that surprised with the, <laughs> with the results? It's kind of crazy. Um, I heard about people losing sleep, uh, friends of mine, like just, you know, being so upset and depressed and anxious because Donald Trump won. And I was like... Wow, that's amazing. So if you haven't watched my video, my quick video on why light workers don't have to fear Donald Trump as president, check out that video. Uh, but basically, um, some of this energy that's healing is a great opportunity for us. So those of you that are sensitive and are empathic, uh, this might affect you in various different ways. One of the things that's affected me is that I have been proxying for Mother Earth the last three to four days around the full moon. So sometimes I'll wake up and I'm not even me. When I muscle test, I'm her. So I'll say my name is Mo Mother Earth and I'll be strong. Then my name is Karen Can, I'll be weak. Then I know there's some healing to do for Mother Earth. Then I go ahead and do the healing and do my Topican healing for Mother Earth. Sometimes I just take the shortcut and just ask, you know, is it something I need to know? And if it's no, then I ask, is my Ascension 1 product or Ascension 2 product good to heal the Mother Earth in this particular respect? And then I get an answer. It's either one or two or both. And then I just go ahead and play that particular healing product and those energies and direct it with my mind to Mother Earth. So that makes it a lot faster <laughs> uh, and quicker. And same thing with mass consciousness. Um, there's a lot of things, if we resonate with mass consciousness on any level, even in our past or future lives, um, the, the beliefs, the emotions, that kind of thing, because mass consciousness is healing, you actually might feel pretty uncomfortable during this time because those things that resonate in you that are healing are going to come to the forefront and they're going to make you uncomfortable and you may even you know, lose, lose your polarity. Um, so uh, you can go ahead and, you know, if you can muscle test, check in, uh, am I empathizing or resonating with mass consciousness right now? And if you are, you can either have a couple of choices. You can separate yourself from mass consciousness uh, or you can send healing to mass consciousness, unconditional love and with yourself. And that usually will do the trick. Of course, you can always ask if you have the essential products. What would be helpful in this case, Ascension 1 or Ascension 2 and direct it to whom? Myself or mass consciousness, or Mother Earth, or, you know, whoever it is. So if you haven't been feeling that great lately or not been sleeping, it's probably a combination of the wonderful Ascension energies that we've been um, uh, healing from, uh, healing with, I should say, and a lot of the old stuff is coming to the surface to heal. So sometimes that can be kind of uncomfortable. I know people sometimes think, oh, the Ascension is so great, all these wonderful high vibes. You know what, with the high vibes come the... Uh, outcropping of the old vibes that need to release so sometimes you need to be a little patient and realize that it's just passing through it's just leaving you now and you can quicken it up and if you have not listened to the radio show with me and Lottie Cooper about how to thrive and not just survive as an empath if you're sensitive at all you definitely want to listen to the replay of that show that we aired on Monday there are a lot of healing activations there so you will just be receiving 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 the whole time you listen to the show so I highly recommend that you uh, check it out 
And uh, next week's show I'm really excited about too uh, because my friend Jenny Nill is back and she's going to be doing some mini healings and clearings for us. And we're going to be talking about abundance and her special abundance package and how she discovered that there are certain elements that are required in order for you to be a money magnet. How cool is that? So she can, she's going to share uh, with us some of her cheat sheet on um, how you know or how close you are to being a money magnet. And you'll get those exact percentages of what needs to happen in order for you to be a money magnet. So that has been really, really awesome. And I think it's been really helpful for me too. So check out that show. And, um, you know, th there's been a lot of upgrades that I've done to the healing uh, uh, products, the Ascension 1 and 2. And one of the things I recently healed, if I hadn't mentioned it before, was just our ability to hold our healthy boundaries while we ascend. This has been very difficult. Um, time and time again, I've asked, well, I'm getting a little sweaty here in the bath. Um, <laughs> time and time I've asked about whether we could hold our healthy boundaries. And it's been really difficult. I've had to, you know, re- um, you know, reestablish, restore healthy boundaries after each ascension. And uh, since last week, uh, we have the ability now with the new ascension upgrades to be able to hold healthy boundaries, even though we are ascending. So yes, there's a few people that might have some imbalances or glitches that prevent them from doing that. But the Ascension 2 is now programmed and upgraded to ex exactly do that. So with the Ascension upgrades, not only will you ground properly uh, the Ascension, uh, helping to ground you to, um, you know, whether it be your own blueprint or to Mother Earth, what is for your highest and greatest good, and be able to hold those healthy boundaries. So those of us empathic types don't have to keep feeling other people's stuff just because we went through an Ascension upgrade. Is that cool or cool? <laughs> uh, also, too, for those of you in my Light Warrior Boot Camp and who've, uh, you know, purchased um, a package from From Heartache to Joy, uh, we have just in, uh, uploaded a new version of my clearing and protection spray. So Jennifer will be loading that up onto the thank you page that you might have bookmarked if you were part of my uh, subscribers. So that's free for you. So if you've already subscribed to KarenCan.com, um, that thank you page that you may have bookmarked will be changed in the next probably 24 to 48 hours with the new video of the uh, entity clearing, energy clearing, protection spray. So check out the new video. Um, I worked on it today and increased the power levels and sophistication so that actually um, you're going to be able to drink probably as much as you want of that spray and not have to worry about how many ounces because there's a little bit more intelligence in the Topican healing uh, infusion of the spray so that if you drink eight ounces versus two ounces, whatever, um, it only that which is for your highest and greatest good will be ingested and taken in and anything that is too much, um, your body won't respond to. So you don't have to worry too much about excessive detox, cool or cool. Anyway, so I hope to see you on the show next week. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do that now. And I better stop this in uh, this because I'm getting really sweaty. <laughs> ah, hope you guys are enjoying a bath once or twice a week, and uh, the full moon is a good time to do that. So happy full moon, happy super full moon, everyone, and I love y'all. Bye for now. <laughs>